after how'd you feel it went out there for you today um i thought it was pretty successful um for the most part um with the ball well got some first downs the offensive line, the offensive line played pretty well um receivers um did a good job sitting in holes stuff like that um, had one three and out um which we can't have but uh, overall for the most part i thought it was a good day there were a few series where, where i think you were one was four for four one was seven for seven why, why, why were the receivers so open today? And why was it so? The rhythm seemed to be pretty good. Throughout. Yeah, I, I think that uh, we just, you know, today was the day we just matched really well. Um, we've been working on stuff all spring long. Um, and finally, uh, you know, overall today, I think that both teams, Crimson and Gray, uh, played pretty well on offense. Um, Gordon moved the ball, scored a few touchdowns. Um, we moved the ball, scored a few touchdowns. And um, I thought all the receivers played really well. It's nice to get the juices flowing in this kind of atmosphere too. To everybody kind of get up for it. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think that having the you know the scoreboard on and the play clock on, um, you know, Pac-12 Network, everybody out here, um, it, it got the guys going a little bit. There's definitely a little more energy than usual. Um, it was a lot of fun just to get out here and play, um, and especially in front of uh, all the Coop fans that came out to support. I uh, really appreciate that, and uh, it was a lot of fun. How fun was it for you as a competitor? You mentioned that you and Anthony are great friends. You guys were just slinging it out there, you know. You guys didn't skip a beat. So was there a little bit of a the competitor competitor come out? Yeah, no, I was. I mean, I was definitely on the, the Crimson team, and I was rooting for our guys, and he was on the great team rooting for his guys. But uh, it was fun, you know. I was, you know, look at, at the plays that he was calling or the coach the coach was calling, and uh, you know, I could just I could just see him back there, and um, he was making great decisions and was making some great throws, and uh, I thought he moved the ball really well. And uh, but yeah, you know, I'm, I'm glad that we won. I'm glad that. Uh, that the, the Crimson team came out on top. And uh, the offensive line, do you think this is one of the best performances from them as a whole uh, this spring? Yeah, I thought I think that they've done a, a good job all the way throughout. I don't think that today was just, just the bright point. Um, I think that they've, they've played pretty well all the way throughout spring. Um, and uh, I, was, I was really pleased with how they played today. Talk about getting comfortable. Yeah. It seemed like you were from the very first snap. Did it feel that way to you from the start? Uh, a little bit. I think I had a few throws where um, I felt like I had a little bit more pressure than what I really did. Um, I was still able to complete a couple passes, but um, as as I played more, the more comfortable I got. And again, that's because I had a clean pocket because the players up front were playing really well. Um, and so, yeah. Let's talk about Kyle. through the uh, long pass down the middle to sweep. Uh, yeah, we motioned. Uh, we motioned to uh, trips right, and uh, it was just an all vertical play. And I, you know, caught the ball, looked up, and uh, just saw that he was moving to space. And um, I thought Kyle had a great day; had a bunch of catches. Um, and yeah, I just just saw him and uh, was able to to get it over the the linebackers, and he made a great catch and great run. Trey, Trey with three touchdowns, a couple hundred uh, yards, probably had the best day of the three quarterbacks. How does that feel to be at the top in such a close quarterback battle? Um, again, I think I'm just I'm just more happy with the way the, the entire offense played on both sides. Um, it was good, you know. I'm, I'm glad that we were able to move the ball and, and get in the end zone. Um, but again, as as a unit, spring ball is about getting better as a team, and I thought that um, the team definitely got better. Um, and yeah, I thought we moved the ball well. This isn't the first time Callis had a bunch of catches in one of these spring scrimmages. What, what do you think's made the difference within this this spring? And how has he developed since, since last fall? I think that um, that Kyle's had a great spring and. He's one of the most experienced guys we have. You know, he's the older guy now, and so he's stepping into a, more of a leadership role, and I think that he's done a great job with that. Um, and yeah, um, with the with the experience, he's sitting in zones, he's running against man, and uh, he's playing really well right now. Thanks, Trent. Thank you. Thank you.